Hello, my name is Eddie Tofpik. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here is your daily technical analysis of stock index futures. I'll start with the UK FTSE futures. After last Thursday's obtuse patterns of an indecisive doji cross that could also be seen as a key reversal up, which opened the way to a lot of possibilities, we had on Friday another obtuse pattern a lower but still indecisive spinning top. However, as I mentioned last Friday, we also had to take into consideration that the action since mid-March could also be a possible double top, which it turned out to be, with the additional feature of a break lower from the recent bull channel. These last two pieces, the break lower from the bull channel and the double top pattern, they were justified by last Friday's actions. Now, as again I mentioned on Friday, we had an initial potential target X in the 7413 area with a secondary target X1 in the 7363 area. These are close to the short medium moving average currently at 7412 and the medium moving average currently 7388. All this of course sits in the shadow of February's monthly key reversal up but there is an important caveat. Last week was a weekly key reversal down which counters the monthly key reversal up in February quite a bit. Now, so far today, gapping lower open, which reached target X at 7413, also target X1 at 7363, plus punching down through both the short and short medium moving averages. The market only halted upon approach to the lesser Fibonacci congestion at 7291 and 7287, as well as the slowly rising long moving average just below that at 7249. German DAX futures. If the opens of the last two sessions had been just that little bit closer, then I could have called the last two days as a bearish separating lines pattern. But they aren't. They are indeed more bearish than that. You see, Friday opened and closed under the very recent 50% Fibonacci line at 14,342. And importantly, well below the falling short medium moving average currently 14,370. Additionally, it was a fresh close back below the neckline currently 14,246 of the December 2021 to February 2022 head and shoulders top. Finally, it appears as the top of the market last Thursday was capped by the upper time, currently 14565 of the January to late March bearish shift pitchfork, and the base by the broken upper time, currently 14080 of the bearish Andrews pitchfork, the same move as the bearish shift pitchfork. Now I was going to retire this more acute bearish Andrews pitchfork and just keep the shallower bearish shift pitch for going forward, but I may reconsider this going forward. So far today, a gapping lower open since filled in that saw prices drop into the wide congestion 13804 to 14079 and hold there for now. The key levels in this band are the February 2020 high at 13821 and the 50% Fibonacci line of the October 2020 to November 2021 move at 13804. U.S. E-mini S&P futures. As I said last Friday about the previous sessions or Thursday's action, and I quote, Yesterday's action here was no doubt the most interesting of all the stock index futures moves, with the market moving down with a combined very large key reversal down and bearish engulfing pattern. Prices then dropped down to finish near to last Friday. That's the previous Fridays. Um, and this past Monday's closes at 43.87. This keeps prices below all the moving averages and not far from the very recent 50% Fibonacci line of 43.66. All the action these last four days, including the lows made last Monday after Easter, have set up the market to possibly make a weekly key reversal this week. End of quote. Well, the market did indeed make a weekly key reversal down, as last Friday prices punched down through the 50% Fibonacci line at 43.66 and all the way down to just under the middle time, currently 42.72 of the January to late March bearish shift pitchfork. Below, we now have light support at the lesser Fibonacci line at 42.05, but nothing of note until the March lows at 41.38 to 41.39. So far today, a lower open and fresh attempt lower, though it seems a cautious one at the moment as prices approach the lesser Fibonacci lines at 42.05. Please note that 
all of today's action so far is below the middle time, a significant piece of information. Thank you for listening. The short version broadcast gives the essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk of slam person with this broadcast. Copyright is Eddie Topic and ADM Investors International Limited. And here comes the final bit. <laughs>